brooding about breakfast? <laughs> no, I gave up on that idea. I haven't given up on us. I just have to find a more interesting way to get us back together. I don't think that family meals are the answer. Good thing we didn't have a food fight. <laughs> Maybe good therapy. I could see us all hurling quiche at each other. Knowing your brother and your father, they would have put rocks in theirs. I'm beginning to think maybe I have rocks in my head for thinking I can bring peace to this family. Not that I don't have anything better to do. You think about going back to work? For Daddy and Craig? Uh, well, I know your father offered you a job. Unfortunately, his ulterior motives were showing. Trying to fix you up with Craig all the time, huh? Mama, I'm not going to get involved with anyone for a while. Daddy has the right to his opinion, but I have a right to my life, and I think he's controlled that long enough. I can just see me. I'm 80 years old, sitting on his lap, and he's telling me he did everything to protect me. I think maybe you could go a little easy on him now. He's hurting as much as the rest of us, maybe even more. He just handles it in a different way. Yeah, the walls go up, and he becomes unreachable. Yeah, he does, and he also lashes out. And you just become more forgiving. If that's possible, how do you do it? You just keep taking it and you give back all this strength and compassion, Mama. Sooner or later, I think everything comes full circle. I hope. So instead of dwelling on what's happened, I can't do anything about that. I'm trying to focus on what's going to come. And that is when this family is all together again. See, we're working for the same end. I just wish we could figure out how to speed it up. We will. We'll figure it out. And we'll get the family back together, Mama. I know. 